Hello, my friends, and welcome to what is definitely going to be the final episode of The Legend of Dragoon. My name is The Flightless Bird, this is your service giving channel, and today, well, we're on the moon, and we're in the final part of Endgame, I think. I I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure we're being the game today. If, if it takes me an hour or two hours, whatever, we're, we're going to beat this game. But before we do, we have a couple of dragon magic to watch. So I went ahead and reloaded a previous save and we're going to see Miranda and Rose pop off. So let's go ahead and get to it, shall we? I hope you're all having a wonderful, fantastic, amazing, awesome day today. Got a cool transformation. Very, very cool. Light, strength, 100% all HP? Huh? What does that mean? I don't know. Let's find out. A giant spaceship. Oh my gosh, that thing is incredible. Oh, it does super damage and heals everyone. That's what all HP meant. Man, that's incredible. That's amazing special. 100% too. That is absolutely amazing. And she looks beautiful as well. Absolutely beautiful. Where there is light though, there is also darkness. The dark dragon. Is it Michael? Did she summon Michael? Oh, that's cool. Look, the shadow is attacking it. <laughs> that's amazing. That is amazing. Very, very, very cool. Thank you, Fleeting Day, for pointing out to me, hey, we need to see these dragon forms because those were amazing. Absolutely amazing. You know what we should probably do? We should probably make sure we've seen all the forms, even though we've seen the other dragon attacks. So why don't we go ahead and throw in Albert and Hashel in here. And we will... See, there are dragon attacks. And I don't know if I've seen Kongles, but we did see Kongo Brothers summon it, so I think it's the same thing. Just want to make sure we've seen all of them, you know? Poor little dragon guy sitting here chilling until someone ruins his day. Unleash the power of the Violet Dragon. Sorry, little guy. I like how it charges forward and then zaps it at close range. Kind of symbolizes Hashel's character well. Oh, that's a nuke that just went off. 
thought Mario was the only one who could throw nukes around. That's incredible. That's really awesome. Oh, let me go before he transforms. This way I don't have to do a circle to try to find another fight. Albert looks so cool in his dragon form. Like some people don't look as cool. But his looks cool. Like Hashel seems like it's too bulky for him. The way they designed it. His looks like it fits perfectly. Things looks like Emerald Weapon from Final Fantasy 7. So cool. Alright, that was pretty amazing. That was pretty dang amazing. You know, if we're showing out the dragon forms, we might as well show off Kongles just to make sure. I don't want the big guy to not get screen time because this game has already screwed him over quite a lot, right? So let's go ahead and show off Kongol's attack. I see Mero. I just saw her in our party. I don't know why. She's super fast. Not gonna really help me get to Kongol faster, but you know, Kongol has had a tendency to start first for some strange reason, so I eh, never know. Hey, how about that? Yep, you started first. Dragon. All right, his is just like a giant tank. That's pretty awesome. It doesn't even fly. It just falls and then sucks things in and then obliterates them. <laughs> I love that. That is so cool. All right, I, I, okay, fine, fine, fine. I, I hear you all. We're showing off all the dragon forms. Well, if we're showing off all the, uh, the dragon attacks. Why don't we show off mirrors as well? And I'm pretty sure we'll see. No, I could end with dark. He still has the redstone, I believe, in this uh, save. So we'll end with Dark. We'll show off all seven magic attacks. I like mirrors. I mean, I like water, so. I mean, the fact that it looks like a giant kaiju swimming underneath, so ominous. I still know how that doesn't hit everyone in, you know, on the board. Oh my god, 3,720. That is insane. That is ridiculous. All right, Dart, finish this off. All seven dragon magic at the start of this video. Why the heck not? Darts and uh, Lavin's armor are kind of similar, aren't they? Just knows that. Oh, Albert. Dart and Albert. I, I keep saying Lavin's. You know? Lavitz had some armor like that too. I, I like to think the reason Darts and uh, Albert's armor is so similar is because it's, you know, inspired by Lavitz, who's our bro, right? A 
it did like no damage. Okay, well we had some fun with that. Let's go ahead and make sure we don't save over our file, that'd be bad. Let's go ahead and load our file up here in the moon. And let's crack on, shall we? Uh, our last battle. Okay, well, it's definitely our last battle. Then we need to prepare. Uh, do we need to prepare? I don't think we do. I just want to make one last check. I could give Dart his ultimate weapon, but Claymore's pretty good. I like the rainbow earring. I the rainbow earring probably could save my life. Uh, let's see. Meru has a phantom shield. That's fine. Along with dancer shoes, rainbow dress, dragon helmet, and a basher. That looks good. Endora's axe, phoenix bloom, arm reviewer, combat shoes, and bandit ring. That all looks good, too. Yep, I think we're ready to go. Dang it, I pressed the wrong button. I didn't press the wrong button. I I'm trying to skip the text to like get me faster to the screen and it's instantaneous so I can't skip the text because I already skipped. Let's go, a last battle. After many moments of hesitation. Oh, come on, stop. Okay, they didn't switch my party, that's good. It's kind of weird because you can adjust your party anytime. I guess I'll give you one last chance to make sure. They have acquired all the immortality. And the ultimate power! I am the god! Who purifies the world! Under the fate determined by Soa! Death to those who rebel against fate! Death to our life! And may your death bless the new world to which I shall descend! Ah! We won't let you, crazy lunatic. We are the Dragoons. We are ready to fight against fate. Let's go. And we also have the new Dragoon form, right? It's probably a brand new form. Oh, look at this music. There are multiple targets. Power extreme. Look at that thing! That looks ridiculous! In a good way. So we have all and single. Yeah, let's definitely do all, considering there's like 50,000 arms here. Maybe it's done better to power them up first, but. Oh, it's about time we get this attack. I remember this being done against me a few times. Okay, uh, I would like to... Hmm, this is tough. Because I want to power up. She could do this, though. That's not going to hurt. Because I don't want to use the psych bomb unless she's powered up. Oh, no X. I'm here mashing X. There is no X. The mash. All right, got rid of all the little appendages. Hopefully he does some more. You know he's going to, right? Super magic ice spell on Kongo, that kind of sucks. That's gonna hurt. A 
let me power up Dart. Because he has that single target attack that might be really effective here. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna speed down the Melbu from Ma. Uh, And you're gonna let loose with uh, the cannon attack. Oh, that's so cool to have the Divine Dragon special abilities. That's so neat. I did miss the red form, don't get me wrong. But this is cool. Wow, look at that. Let's go. That didn't do as much damage as I was hoping now. Alright, I need you to attack to build SP. Just delay waste on me. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Let's see if I can do it. Dang it, I think I did it too early. First time I did it too late, that time I did it too early. Pretty decent damage, so that's not bad. Kanga, I really want to get you in on this. Need you to build up more. How did I miss the last one? Come on. Still though, I missed the last one on the uh, previous attack. Uh, that makes me mad. What are you doing, big boy? Like, no sound to this at all. The first generation. Okay, are we fighting Lavos here? Come on, Flightless. Now's not the time to choke, man. 
I mean, I, I don't think this is going to do more damage than a normal attack. But if it does, you might as well waste all your MP on it just to, just to do as much damage as you can with one shot. You kind of hope this does about 1800 damage. Alright, that was, um, that was not great. That was not great at all. How am I constantly missing that last herg? Okay, you're fully powered now. You can unleash your magic. May not be a bad idea. into a lot of damage. Is this thing strong against magic? No, I think, I, I just think it's strong, period. You know what I mean? Because he seems to be Resisted to like everything. Come on, Flightless. You can do better than that. Yeah, let's keep building up the SP back. Jerk. Unfortunately, the person I was going to heal with is currently stuck. Yes. Could always use a healing ring too. It sucks because Mero is so fast and she's stuck in that stupid thing. Give me back my Mero!
Do I go Dragoon? Yeah, I'll probably go Dragoon. I get those stat buffs. Even though I don't have access to items, it's a little bit risky, but what the heck. Nice. That was cool. Dang it, I missed. Don't be really good with his. Am I ever gonna get my mare back? That one hurt. You can defend now, so that's cool. Dang it, I missed. <laughs> Give me back my girl, dang it. Oh, well, she's back. Unfortunately, it one hit KO'd him. And I have no way to restore him. Wonderful. That really sucked. I guess you gotta be careful what you ask for, huh? I'm in trouble here. Because it's a bull card game mechanic. And I don't mean the fact that I'm Dragoons, I mean the fact that I never had a chance to defend with him. I'm like, oh, he's dropping out Dragoon for that's okay. And the guy got three attacks and they all hit Kongle. And they basically just wasted him. It really sucked. Second generation. Oh, is it gonna transform again? This is bad. I need I need to get Kongle up. Dragon form is actively working against me right now. It's getting serious now. It's so weird how there's like no sound for this. Fourth generation. Wait, did you just come over the third? Oh, music just picked up. Let's go. Okay, uh, Meru's almost done with her dragon form. That's good. Uh, should I heal? I don't, don't I really need heal though. 
I mean, I'm probably gonna do a, uh... I'm probably gonna do a, uh, a healing rain. Once I get Congo up. Yeah, I know this fight probably could've been easier if I had a legendary cast on Congo and he wouldn't have died, but... I don't wanna win that way. Okay. Mary is back in regular form. Which means I can now use an angel prayer to recover Congo. You can keep attacking. Already at yellow, nice. Yeah, did it again. Cool. Sorry, that did 3,000 damage, okay. So let's say, if that just one-shot Congo, I would be really, really bad. Uh, Killing Ring. Congo Smash. Dart. Uh, do I want to smash him? I could power it down. And I think I'm just going to attack with her to build up her SP again. Yeah, I know I have attack items I can throw. It's just, geez, she's doing more damage than Congo. That's unfair. Huh? Okay. Am I getting another turn here, Mero? Because now would be a really good time for a Psych Bomb X. And I gotta hope this actually hits him. And it doesn't just do zero damage because of some other mechanic. Good, it actually hit him. Didn't kill him though. Hmm. Almost killed him. Uh, I'll take almost. Ah, oh, I missed the last one. Dang it, he didn't get full 100 SP. It's really annoying. Amaro, I need your other turn. Thank you. Don't gotta mash this one out. Cool. Excellent. Fifth generation? How many generations? Do we gotta go through all 108? Because if we have to do that, this is gonna take me all night. 
I know I said this is gonna be the final hour video, whether it takes an hour or two hours, but this video is like seven hours long. I don't think I've ever fought a final boss that had this many forms. Oh, he skipped the fifth. Okay, going straight to the sixth. Okay, Paleolithic times? Neolithic times? Uh, okay? Primitive humans? I like the artwork a lot, though. Look at him, like a giant deformed manta ray or something. He's red too, which, huh? All right, well, let's end this. All right, he doesn't have 50,000 more forms. Oh, well, we'll end this form, how's that? Oh, there we go. That's the damage I need from you, Congo. No, it's not. I've seen this before. Yeah. Well, that hurt a lot. the time now is not the time to miss I swear she's all like pixelated I swear if you captured her again I'm gonna be so mad apparently Mary's going to the phantom zone okay I can live with that I can live with that Okay, so this HP is a lie. Because it was red and he's still attacking. Come on, you'd use the same ability on the same character. I need to get Mara's turn so I can heal. Although I may have to fire off a healing rain. Oh! Nice shot there. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let, let's go. Heal my party? Good, good, good. That kiss me in the fight. And now you could, I, I say you just uh, let loose. Do what you do best, Queen Mero.
Now maybe it would have been better if I just did a regular attack. Alright, we got minions. Now what is he doing? He transformed again. Dragoon form. Oh, that sucks. All right. Uh, four. And Mary still has two turns left. How many more attack items do I have? So I have quite a few. My quite a few. I mean, a lot. Let's use them. I hope this thing does a one-hit KO error now. Oh, that, that swept away the little guys, okay. That was good. Oh, what just happened? Uh, I don't want to go Dragon Form. Destroy? Did I win? Super Duper Cinematic Slash? I think I won! Let's go! Finish this start. Generations for you. Hopefully. This could just be a probably nope. Beat the final boss. Huzzah! Save a girl, save a girl, save a girl. It's like a giant monster scooping her up. Oh, look at that sword. Oh, that's I so cool. I wish I had Rose in my palm right now. I kept you waiting so long. I'm sorry. Sacrifice herself, isn't she? Don't do it, Rose.
our father. Please forgive me. But, but, father! We finally met! This isn't fair! Dart, I'm so glad I met you. The head off the sink, all the vases are dying. My role is ended. Place the weight to the future by yourself. This is your age to live with Shana. What are you talking about? We can all live together. We were never meant to exist in this. Thank you, Rose. Thank you, Dad. What a what a what a bittersweet ending. I mean, at the at the same time, though, I mean, Rose has been immortal for so long, and she, she, I mean, she's she's been on this quest to to kill people to save the world. I mean, that can't feel good. She she didn't like her mission, and. I know that she didn't, she didn't like what she did, but at the same time she had to do it to save the world. And the person she loved, you know, now she can be with him. And she can be with all the other of her friends and all of her allies. But at the same time, it doesn't make it any less, any less, you know, hurt to know that the person that we've been with the entire time has to sacrifice herself so that we can live. Thank you, Rose. And I want to say thank you to all who have been a part with me on this journey. Look at Mero. Oh, Mero's showing off uh, her winglies. How awesome humans can be. 
I like that. I, I like that a lot. That's that's my favorite scene so far. Aww. And Albert gets a girl. <laughs> Back home. Chapter 4. That's all the trophies. Hero Legend. Unlock all trophies in the Legend of Dragoon. Alright, well, I mean, that there's nothing else to do. We've unlocked everything. We got the Platinum Trophy. We've done everything there is to do in this game. We saw all the magical attacks, and... I, I love this game, and I thought it was a wonderful experience. Thank you all to everyone who has been telling me for a while to go play this game. Because there's been a lot of people telling me for a while to go play this game. And... I can't thank you enough for doing that. I hate to run this over the credits, but I want to make sure I thank our, our wonderful, amazing supporters of the channel via Patreon and YouTube membership. Uh, thank you, Cryptfinity, Flitting Day, ENL Epitalk, Tapas, ChinnyQT, Techno Trouble, Diesel Knight, Dragon K, Moose Gaming, and Daddy X Day Golf. I, I, you guys are amazing. I don't have words. Thank you for blessing me the way you blessed me. And thank you for everyone else who has blessed me via commenting on the videos, liking the videos, uh, subscribing to the channel, just watching the videos, even if you don't do any of that. Just the fact that you watch the videos is, it, it means a lot to me. And I would love to know your thoughts on the game. I would love to know what you think and what, you know, how you like the game or what your favorite memories are of this game. I'm just glad I was finally able to to enjoy this experience with you all, and it, it's been a lot of fun. It, it's been a lot of fun. Uh, the next game coming to our channel in our RPG spot is Amori, which is a game that was voted on by our community. Uh, this game here was recommended to me by a bunch of people, but I decided to play it without the vote. Because I know that there was a lot of people who wanted to see me play this. So I decided, hey, let's play this and then we'll do a vote. One of the things that I've been trying to do on the channel is uh, I have a free spot where I play any RPG I want. And then the second spot is RPG recommendations. And then I play everything, anything I want, then it's RPG recommendations and so on. And if you would like me to play an RPG, uh, what you need to do is just comment in the uh, comment box and say, Hey, Flightless, I saw your spreadsheet, which is in the description below. Uh, it's basically tinyurl.com slash flightlessbirdgame. Hey, if you go to that spreadsheet, you'll see the games that have been recommended to me. And if you say, Hey, Flightless, you should play this game, I'll put it on the list. And then we vote first on Discord. So every single game on the RPG section is up for a vote. And then what happens is we choose the top five to then come to YouTube, where we have a vote on YouTube. And then the winner, you know, is the game that we play. 
So Omoi won the last poll. I uh, beat out Wild Arms just a little in Radiant Historia. I was going to play Lunar 2 following following Amori, but because Lunar Remastered has been announced, I will probably hold off on playing Lunar. And it's possible I may play Kudelka or Shadow Hearts uh, from a New World. Uh, those are both games in the Shadow Hearts series. And I really would like to complete some of my series. You know, I'm looking at games like Grandia 3, uh, Breath of Fire 1 and 2, you know, the, uh, Le Legend of Legaia 2. The there's quite a few games that I haven't finished in this series. And I would like to try to close those just a bit. So I I'm probably going to play Kodoka or Shadow Hearts from a New World. I know a lot of people didn't really like Shadow Hearts from a New World. Granted, that's a thing. But at the same time... At the same time, it's... it's I, I want it... I want to see why the game is either good or bad. Um, just because some people didn't like it didn't mean that I won't like it. Uh, you know, that's that's just the truth. There are some games that some people don't like, there's some games that you really like, and I really want to see what this story is on Shadow Hearts from a New World. Because Shadow Hearts 2 Covenant, or Shadow Hearts Covenant, is one of my one of my favorite RPGs of all time. I really, 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 really love that game, and I think it's wonderful. So yeah, that's that's basically where I'm going in the future in terms of RPGs. Uh, it's gonna be Omori, probably Shadow Hearts from New World, and then it will probably be a fan vote, um, and that will lead us to probably March, where Lunar 2 will be coming out along with this Wicked in Duology. I may put a hold on the fan vote to play Suikoden so 2 and Lunar 2. I mean, Suikoden so 1 and Suikoden so 2. And uh, Lunar 2. That's something that I probably will do. Just because those are games I really, 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 really want to play. But as we scroll through the credits, as I said before, if you like what you see, don't forget to hit that thumbs up to like the video. Don't forget to subscribe. It means a lot to me. Comment in the comment section below. You know that you did and I would love to welcome you to the channel also in the comment section uh, also in the description section is a link to my discord my Twitter which I don't use as often come to my discord I use that often and of course our spreadsheet that links to all of our playthroughs I was about to say that's it Aww. Red and black. Rose and Zeke. Rest in peace, my friends. The end. Kind of symbolizes, I guess, that they're together and that they've been... That they're living a good life with all their friends. I would like to believe that. Well, I hope you guys have a wonderful, fantastic, amazingly awesome, awesome day. Again, thank you for being here. You're the number one YouTube comedian on YouTube, and I mean that with all my heart. And until next time, so long, and take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember, that you matter, and you are brilliant, and you are loved, and you should always be true to yourself. Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.